Hi, my name is Jerry Dawn McKellar and I'm from Minden, Utah. After reading the story of the Good Samaritan, I am wondering how we truly love our neighbor as Christ did. How do we love those who do not want to be loved? And how do we find a healthy balance with those who require attention constantly? Mike, what are your thoughts? I think Jerry asks a really great question. It is hard sometimes to find the balance in loving people. I, I think a quote from President Nelson is really helpful. It's from his Christmas 2018 Christmas devotional. And he says, Jesus Christ gave you and me an unlimited capacity to love. That includes the capacity to love the unlovable and those who not only do not love you, but presently persecute and despitefully use you. With the Savior's help, we can learn to love as he loved. It may require a change of heart, most certainly a softening of our hearts, as we are tutored by the Savior how to really take care of each other. My dear brothers and sisters, we can truly minister in the Lord's way as we accept his gift of love. And I, I love that imagery of the Savior as our tutor. Tutoring is not usually something that we look forward to. We think it's because we have a problem. But I love tutoring because somebody that knows the subject really well is willing to come and take some one-on-one -on -one time with us. And I think about the Savior as a tutor mm -hmm. of how to love. I can imagine him putting his arm around us and saying, I know you're struggling with that person. Can I just give you a little help? Can I tutor you on how to love this person? Can I teach you specifically what they need? I know that he wants to do that for us. I felt that in my own life, that tutoring as he stretches me. And, and it has taken, as President Nelson said, a softening of my heart and sometimes a breaking of my heart when it was too hard. But it's something that the Lord wants to get us to where we're loving the way he loves and he doesn't expect us to be there right now. In fact, he offers free tutoring, which I think is beautiful.